We're also following breaking news right now in Volusia County. Deputies say the man wanted for setting off a pipe bomb outside his grandfather's home in Oak Hill last week is now in custody. He was arrested less than two hours ago. Channel 9's Mike Springer live at the jail now where the suspect is set to be taken shortly. So, Mike, how did they find him? Well, deputies actually just finished booking uh, Troy Phoenix into the jail here a few moments ago, but the sheriff's office tells us their Marine unit actually got a tip uh, today that Phoenix was living in a home over in Edgewater on Douglas Ave. That's where they found him and say he surrendered peacefully when deputies went to that home to apprehend him. Now, this is some video we shot last week of what all led up to this search for Phoenix. Deputies say they've been looking for him since about Friday or so. His family told us that Phoenix was upset he was being evicted from a shed he was living in at his grandfather's home on Beehive Drive in Oak Hill. Deputies say Phoenix argued with his family about the eviction and even threatened to blow up everyone in the house last Friday. That's when deputies say Phoenix got a pipe bomb, ran outside of the house onto the property, and then lit a fuse and tossed the bomb out from the door into the yard where it exploded. The grandfather also told us that he says his grandson only used a firecracker and wasn't trying to hurt anyone, but the sheriff tells us that explosive, if it had gone off, would have leveled the entire home. No one was hurt, but Phoenix did run off and was late until he was later located uh, just a little while ago earlier today. Now, he is facing several charges while he's booked here at the jail, including possession of an explosive device or material, as well as three counts of aggravated batter or aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. Reporting live in Volusia County, Mike Springer, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.